might have to interrupt the story for a minute. Actually, it's not an interruption. It's a, let's go back for just a minute and kind of talk about where this all started. I am obviously not at camp. I am actually in Salt Lake City right now. And I have Wi-Fi, and I have a bed, and I have a shower. It's pretty nice, but something to fly on my leg. I just got a text from a good friend who I went on an epic adventure with um, a few months ago, and he did several videos from that adventure, and they turned out amazing. We had a blast. And he said, dude, um, remember a while back we went on this like, epic trip together and uh i did a video and i did several videos and well, where's yours but right after that we kind of made this little decision to sell everything and you know go on this huge grand adventure and so i didn't really have a heck of a lot of time to work on other stuff and then i also didn't want to wait too long to start telling you our story of just all the craziness and everything that we've been going through <sighs> I've been busy, very busy, as you can imagine. And I'm just now getting around to it. I apologize, Jason, so much, but here we are. I'm going to put a pause on our current story to back up and tell you another story. So let's get busy with a little bit of editing. Come on.
backstory time. So <laughs> Jason wasn't able to move to Salt Lake City as early as what he wanted to. And so he had actually said, hey guys, no rush on the trailer. I'm not gonna make it out for a while. So, you know, just you know, move me to the back of the line for right now. And so we shuffle things around and we move some people up and we we're building these trailers. And uh, a few weeks later, Jason calls me and he goes, ah, dude, he's like, um, I've got a window. So if there's any way that we could move it back up a little bit, let's do it and, and let's go on this epic adventure. Let's, let's go find some place and you build your trailer at the same time and we'll go and explore and test these things out. We sharpened our pencils and we went back to the schedule and we looked at things and we're like, okay, okay, well, I think we can do this. And we went to the guys and we said, all right, guys, this is gonna be a fast, fast build. Basically got about six days to build two fully loaded expedition trailers. And uh, man, credit to you guys, you pull it together and we all worked as a team and made it happen. So thank you, thank you, thank you for all your efforts. And man, what what a trailer. I mean, right? Have you guys seen this thing? Jason's done an awesome walk around video. I haven't had the chance yet, but you've seen mine in use. I'm living in it. I wouldn't live in this trailer if I didn't trust it and believe in it. I know that these are the most rugged, dependable trailers. I'm really, really, really excited to continue to travel in these things. Here's Jason seeing his trailer for the first time. It does really pop, and it looks great with the gray. Uh -huh. I didn't. I didn't even think about that. I, I, I'm geeking out, like majorly geeking out right now. I can't help it. I'm just like geeking out. And then it also has a triple charge function on it, so you can leave it plugged up to your house. It keeps. It's amazing. I'm really excited about these new models. <laughs> I'm gonna give you a hug. <laughs> yeah. This is awesome. Glad you like it. I love it. We're that filming, filming, filming. Lifestyle Overland Orange. You can call it LA, LO Orange for short. There you go. I, the orange on the black mm -hmm. with the wheels is so good. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. I can't wait to get it behind the, the silver Forerunner and tie all this together. When are you going to do the graphics, get the graphics on the Forerunner? Uh, are you still doing what you were thinking? I, I am. I'm, I'm, I, it's just been a matter of getting the time to, yeah. to do that. So. Yeah, when Oh yeah, and then there's our trailer. Pretty excited about this guy. Yeah, so the lighting's not as good as it was. I've been editing for a while. I've been in the
so we're uh, headed west finally. It's been a crazy week. We put in probably over 80 hours in the course of six, seven days, uh, getting the trailer builds taken care of, getting everything ironed out. We had some, some difficulties with the, the new graphics and stuff, but I tell you what, it was worth every single bit of effort that we put into those things because these trailers are just transformed beyond all the extra little modifications and uh, things that we've done to the 2018 expedition so super super excited we've got swell runner so jason's behind us right now we're working our way through phoenix traffic which thankfully isn't too bad on a sunday evening um, the goal is to make it up to anza borrego tonight and uh find us a cool campsite hang out shoot some videos do a little youtube collab that's collaboration for sure um and who knows we may run up to joshua tree we may get crazy and hit some mojave um, we're just out here having a good time enjoying these brand new trailers now so stick around we'll see what we get into all right guys that's a wrap hey it's only 12 30 in the morning so not too bad i think there was about seven hours worth of editing today maybe eight anyhow thanks for sticking around thanks for hanging out i'll tell you what justin claire you guys are amazing. Thank you for letting us stay at your house. Thank you for the good food, the showers, the bed, the Wi-Fi. It's been a huge, huge help. If you want to see the rest of the story and you haven't already seen it, go over to Jason Kirchie's channel. I'll put a link. It'll go like right there. And click on that. Go check out all his awesome content. I'm going to have a little more coffee. I mean, why not? Oh, yeah. If you like this video, hit the button, subscribe. If you really like what we're doing, check out our Patreon account. For a dollar a month, you'll get access to all the bonus content. And there's gonna be some good stuff because I mean, let's face it, we can be kind of funny sometimes.